What is up guys, Alex here and welcome to a Warzone gameplay. I know you're gonna be like, Whoa, why are you post coming this? Bit weird, I know. But it's because basically the stream audio for some unknown reason completely uh, fucked up, quite honestly. So I was just like, alright, cool, I've got a post commentate this. Anyway, that's my first point. If you didn't know already, I stream on Twitch and I intend on doing stuff like this where I get like highlight games and either post commentating it or getting like my live gameplay and then re uploading it. And I've also thought about doing like a montage of my like best bits through like the month. So, because obviously I've been streaming for about two weeks and it's going pretty well. I'm close to being an affiliate on Twitch. I just need to get my monthly viewers up. That's not one thing. Average viewers up, and if that's something you're interested in, like going to watch me on stream games like Warzone, all that stuff like that, then link will be in the description. Go hit that up. Anyway, so yeah, that's the first plug. Second plug is if you're new to the YouTube channel, subscribe. Every all that good stuff, you know. We've been on here for a while now. Come on, you know. We've got to get the YouTube friend back up going. I don't know how often I'm going to post on YouTube. I think that's more to do with how good I stream, like if I get a good gameplay or like I have like a compilation of clips. So that will just vary how often I actually upload. Because it could be, you know, I upload 10 times in a month or, you know, I upload once in that month. But, you know, we'll see. So anyway, this gameplay, I don't know, it was a bit of a mad start. I was just in a solo's game. I, I was already, I'm already on four kills. Like, for me to have four kills off the start in a solo is pretty decent. I don't usually go in Superstore because I'm just a bit of a pussy when it comes to Warzone. I'm usually a Recon Randy or go to a bunker or something. But, yeah, so um, I got very fortunate, I think, because the first guy I killed was oblivious, I was there, so I just melted him. Then the next couple of people were pretty clueless, which allowed me to get my loadout, which I think, if I hit, yeah, I buy my loadout here. I had like 30k at this point, yeah, 37k. So I was just like, alright, run it up, I don't care. I'm just gonna buy everything I need, straight away. You know what's even more crazy? I won't spoil it, but the end game, I have a fuck ton of money. And I really did need to use it because I was in a bit of a sticky one steal with a certain thing. And it kind of uh, cost us the game, I feel. But, you know. Oh yeah, spoiler, we lose the game. But this is like a really high kill game. So, yeah. It'll be pretty easy to post commentate so because it'll be a lot of action. So here we go, we get my uh, custom loadout. If you want me to do a loadout video for Warzone, It'll probably be this class that I'm running. It's an MP7 and a Graw. The Graw is pretty much everyone else's growl, so you know, it's pretty a standard video. My MP7 is the Zero Recoil ADS Super Fast, I don't know, Glug Glug <laughs> MP7. It's pretty nuts. I'll definitely do a loadout video for you guys at some point if you guys want it, because it's a pretty nutty class, in my opinion. And not many people rate the MP7 in Warzone, and it's a very viable option. I prefer it to the MP5 since the recent patch because the MP5 just seems a bit like it's got too much recoil on your ADS. So this guy got cracked by Gra. I was like, yes, time to pop this dead silence. I thought that was a door. That was for I'm gonna be super smart. Cut him off. I thought he was around the corner because of the heartbeat. Evidently not. He's upstairs, this floor, so I check my corners. I, I played that really dumb, I should have jumped through the window. Because he wouldn't have expected me to jump through the window, he would expect me to come through the door. Then I saw him here, I nearly lost this gunfight. If this gun wasn't such a laser, I actually would have lost that gunfight. So, when I drop my MP7 build, I 100% recommend you lot going to watch, uh, use it in Warzone. It doesn't take much skill. 
This may have been the dumbest play I've ever done. I clustered. I thought, oh yeah, there's one guy in this building. So I clustered. I was like, okay, these roof, he's gonna jump off or rotate down, make it easier for me. I destroyed two vehicles, so I was like, what? And then a third vehicle. And then I got a kill from it, and I was like, what? So I literally think someone drove into my clock. Which wasn't the smartest thing to do, honestly. They quite easily could have just, you know, not done that. And then this is, I just saw him in the corner of my eye. I started panicking, thought I had C4, yep. Yeah. So I died there. It's fine, you know. Gulag's easy, Let, let's clutch this up real quick. Find out where he is, hold left peak until we know. Bit of pre fire, easy as. Alright, I picked up a HG yard. I, I went and picked up my raw. There was a HG on the body, so I was like, alright, cool. I noticed this guy was just trying to laser someone, easy headshot. Um, I can't remember what this bit is. Oh, it's, okay, so I went to the building where I sniped the guy. I saw this guy in heartbeat, I was like, oh, is this guy pushing? No. You see him briefly in that window, so I was like, alright, cool, if I jump this wall, he'd be sitting in the corner probably. Check behind the door just in case, check the heartbeat where he is. He knew I was there, so we both just had to go long heads. I should have just first him straight away and then played it. Uh, I don't know what I was doing. But you know, miss half my <laughs> my shots when he's on the floor, you know. Not really important, but pretty bad for me. I jump roof of the other building, get on top of these hangers. Notice this poor guy running zone. I think you're trying to get in the vehicle near. So that was just unfortunate rotation from him that I was just up there waiting. He couldn't have come out of worse time. Uh, so jump forward a bit in the clip, uh, so basically I lasered the guy out of the sky, chased him to here, couldn't find him. I think he went into that hangar there that I was looking at, so I was just like, alright. So I saw this muscle flash, I was like, nah, there's not going to be a camp of rotating him. So I thought, okay, hold this window, he's not there. I shot a shot because I thought, ah, oh, maybe we'll peek. No, it's another muzzle flash. A, a panic shot to pay, maybe decoy it. He misses. Your boy hits the headshot. Pretty nasty shot. I don't mind saying. I don't really like the red thing. I rotated to the house he was in. And I was like, alright, it's in the head zone. I'll hold it for a little bit. See if anyone else is rotating him. Heartbeat shows a guy in this house. Of course there is. There's always someone in the house. That's a bullshit this game. I can't. This is why it's taken so long to upload a good video to YouTube for Warzone. Because the amount of times I've had like a 10 kill game, 10 people left, I run past the house and just get into the sniper like APR. It's actually the most frustrating thing. See this guy on the board. Poor guy didn't have a trophy. I didn't see him, waiting to see the smoke clear, the self res. Easy kill there. Alright, so the zone's coming in from that kill. So I decided to go uphill, get my loadout, get my ghost class, get the HDR, my custom HDR. It has a suppressor on it. Poor guy rotating in, gets headshot. Poor poor guy. Zooming forward a bit, I go straight over. I, I saw some people in the distance, I can't really see them though. I saw this guy up here, missed the first snipe. See a glimpse of the head, stay still if you want. You're dead. Don't stand still in water, that's my tip. If you're camping on an antenna or in a building, do not stand still by the window or out in the open because you're going to get sniped. There's too many people that have sniping in this game as their secondary. Like, personally, I run Brawl and MP7 or Growl or Bruin, but this guy would be an annoying. Oh, this guy actually cost me the game. Most frustrating dude. Like, I thought he was up on a tower because of the way he was just lasering me in stupid angles. Right? You see his, you just saw his muscle flash. I don't know why he kept gunning for me like he was, but you know. So I have 50k at this point. 
with no plates. Why can't, like, if I had a buy station, I could have just, I literally, if listening to the audio when I'm speaking in the street, I was like, oh, it's an 18 kill game, please, and I just win this. I think at this point I had 5k damage, so I was just like, fuck, this is a good game, come on, this would be such a good YouTube video. 18 kills with four people left. I mean, you're still seeing it, so you know, you gotta show your losses and your W's. I just said in the game that got 50 k no players. Alright, so I, I was really indecided whether I peaked this kid. So I peaked him, broke shield, peaked back in. It's like that. Nah. I should have checked the heartbeat here. I should have checked the heartbeat here. Because I would have known where the other two people were. But I only knew where that one guy was. I decided to take the syringe, I was like, alright, I might have to do a little bit of a storm play here. Don't check my straight ahead. This guy's already shooting me. There's the L.